All right, hello and welcome back. This is David with Fairmere's Rangers, and we're picking back up with our pirate campaign. And we're, uh, I think we're like 16 turns in, and we have conquered pretty much all of South America, or I should say North South America, uh, as the rest of South America isn't represented. And we're making our way up to Panama right now. Uh, with this army here It's gonna be a few turns before we make it uh, Actually three to be clear and we have uh, Hispaniola and of course we have all of these islands as well So we've carved ourselves out a pretty decent little empire so far uh, I am kind of concerned just because I don't have enough naval power still I do have a couple of fleets that are pretty good, uh, but I, I need to capture more fifth rates and uh, just get some better coverage there. Uh, but yeah, that's where we stand. Uh, we're currently making 1368, which is not a lot. Um, yeah, it's it's just not going well. I actually had to reduce my taxes because all my uh, all the regions I was owning the population was going down which means less taxes so I had to reduce the tax on the lower class in order to basically increase my population so increased population means more money in the long run so let's hope we can get to the long run <laughs> we can only hope all right let's see how this intern goes Just hoping, um, I, I'm, I know it's inevitable that we're going to have a uh, European nation send a fleet over here to try to take some of our captured regions. So that's why I've got kind of a naval blockade going. I haven't really seen too many ships coming and that's kind of the lifeblood of my income is capturing enemy ships. So yeah, it's kind of a problematic thing. But we'll try and make do the best we can. Alright. Fleet arrives. That's my ship from Europe that we need to get fixed up. You're going here. Okay. Get you fixed up and then we'll send them back to Europe. Or actually, we'll send you back to Europe. Need to capture more ships. Alright. What else we got going on here? All right, let's continue you with your march up. We did get um, this completed. Don't really have much money. Only 14 next turn. This one we should be able to take off exemption. Okay, that is the case. It puts us up to 1926, which is very nice that's let's just check out the population growth so we're making basically a 0.21 percent not a whole lot of increase in population that one's really bad um yeah this one's even going down at least these aren't going down anymore but yeah, and, and the other problem is I can't build up my buildings any more than what we got. So we're, we're not going to be able to build our economy up too much here. Uh, I can't recruit any more troops. All I can recruit is these guys. And they don't even carry swords. Like, they have them in the picture, but I, I go to... Uh, like, one guy has a sword. The rest of them got fists. They got their fists. They don't even get to pick up rocks. It's freaking a crime against humanity. Uh, but it is what it is. All right. Um, that being said, I don't think there's anything else we can do. Uh, we can at least bank that money and move on to the next turn. So let's do that. All right. We got a Dutch fleet here, um, which is a good thing. But I don't want to take this on with just a Zebek. Um, I don't want to lose it. I want to. I would rather get my fifth rates over there. Same thing. 
Hopefully he goes over and takes on the... Oh, he doesn't, but he's at least in uh, range where we can capture him. So that's a good thing. Alright, it is my turn. Let's go ahead and work on getting these ships. Okay, let's do it. Alright, we're about to get the action started. There goes the mast. rock their world there it seems okay so he's lost a mass let's go ahead and go in for the kill there goes another one and the admiral he must have been sailing up on that mast all right there goes all their mast easy pickings now we'll only have to take front cannons from the uh, fifth rate on our approach hopefully he breaks as soon as we get here yep okay good limits our damage Okay, he did it. Alright, and yes, we are going to take the fifth rate, even though that is going to be another expense for us. At least we get the 1500 out of the flute. Okay. Going to need to get these guys back for repairs. We'll send you guys over here. Let's get our Zebex back on our warning system warning protection if you will okay got our blockade going all right you keep making your way do need to get a ship over there to transport them after we take Panama I don't want to spend like three years going through the jungle so I'll bring a ship over take them over to Guatemala that way and who knows maybe we can even take Mexico I think what we're going to do, um, let's go ahead and spend the money on building up this region. We got to get this region as being our major power here. And actually, Windward Islands is one of our few regions that's uh, really having negative growth. And hopefully that can be changed by building this up but might be wise to go ahead and build these regions up because these are better money making regions so maybe we do that maybe we spend our money there We're making 1600 next turn let's see we got two more turns for that to be finished three more turns there what else we got four turns on that 
Yeah, so we're way behind in economic uh, growth, if you will. All right, let's pick these guys up. That does hurt our economy. No, not too bad. All right, so let's go ahead and transport you guys over here. And we'll meet them at Panama and be able to push on. Okay, that way we can start carving up some more regions as quickly as possible. Um, I don't think there's really much else to do this turn. Uh, maybe we can scout with this ship uh, just to see if there's any more fleets. And there doesn't seem to be. I'm going to come back over. Keep this raided. Alright, let's end the turn. Alright, so there is a Dutch ship there. Um, that is a pleasant sight to see. Hopefully we get to see some more here soon. I almost want them to pick up that Dutch army uh, so they get vacated out of Caraco and then we can take that. But that's going to be a risk. Alright, our turn has come. Fleet arrives. Let's get up here. Maybe we can find some action in Gibraltar. Got another fleet arrives. That's you. I forgot about him. Let's get you refitted. And same with you. That ship just came from India, if you're wondering. Okay. You take their position. And we do have this fleet here. It's a fifth rate. Let's go ahead and get him. Now, I do have to make a decision. Are we keeping them or are we going to keep the money? So this is a really tough decision. Do we keep it or do we let it go? Uh, and, I mean, make the money. I think right now, honestly, I need the money. I need the money way bad. All right. We're 1400 a turn right now. We can build up one of these regions. That's what I believe we need to do as well. Let's get back on this trade route. Brings us up to 1509. Right. Onward. I think I can. Okay, good. Demand surrender. Refused, you bastards. Alright, we should be able to auto resolve that. Lost 12 men. Capture it, though. Okay. Did we get any chevrons at least? Hell no. Alright, so. What does that do for the economy? Doesn't do much, let's put it that way. Hopefully when this is built up, it'll it'll help a bit. But this actually will help. Um, let's see what's trading for more. Uh, sugar or coffee. Of course, this will change over time. So sugar is way more, and I'm going for the now versus the later. Um, yeah. Okay. So hopefully this is going to help us out in the long run taking this region. Where are we at right now? Yeah, it's actually under control. So in a few turns, we'll run this army over. Actually, matter of fact... Next turn, we can load these guys up and start moving them on to Guatemala and hopefully take out Guatemala. I think we can get that done. This is 
probably going to be one of those campaigns where things are going okay right now, but they're they're probably going to go south any moment. All right, so everything was pretty quiet. We actually got two thousand right now. Fifteen eighty nine next turn. Um, let's see here. Still three turns away here. And we're so underdeveloped, it's not even funny. Uh, let's take a look at this. I'm actually making good money here. Let's go ahead and build up this region. Yeah, because we can build this region up as well. I mean, because there's a couple mines, we can build everything uh, here. I mean, that's going to add a lot of wealth. Okay, let's get you guys... Okay. Come on, get on board. Damn it. The hell's blocking the path. Using all my movement on this. Finally, Jesus. Alright. Onward to Guatemala. Okay, now let's head over to Europe. Let's hope and pray there's some fleets here. If not, we'll raid this shipping here. Brings us to 1922. What a year, right? Alright, we'll see what we get as far as fleets. I'm sure they're not going to like this. We're completely blockading this uh, route here. And... Let's see. We do need to get you refit, but you're switching over with them. You get refit. Actually, I don't. Just get on the trade route. Brings this only up a little bit, bastards. All right. You don't want all these fifth rates sitting here idle alright so what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave one fifth rate here Be you other two fifth rates you guys are going on a seek and destroy mission okay things are looking good there I don't like leaving this behind but we got plenty to be able to take care of them. Just want to be in striking distance. Alright. Yeah. Only 48 left. Let's end the turn. You know, I, I just actually had an interesting thought. I wonder in vanilla if the Dutch get taken out, this goes pirate. I wonder if I would get their troops, if that would be the case. Let's take a look at the Dutch. Hopefully they're not doing well. We can't even look at them that way. Um, they still only cl uh, control uh, Amsterdam in Europe, so that's kind of a good thing. I still see no shipping here, which is so unusual for Empire. But it's part of this mod, so it is what it is. All right. Um, that being said, 1986 is what we got to spend. We're actually making 2,000 uh, next turn, so that's a nice uh, increase. Let's go ahead and drop these boys off. I guess that's the best place. The next turn, we'll be able to see what we're up against in Guatemala. Uh, let's go ahead and bring you back down to gather these guys up. Uh, Jamaica is another region that we're going to have to get. There is still troops here. Okay. So this is this is definitely not going to be easy. I mean, line infantry, artillery. I, I can't beat that with what I got. I simply can't unless I bring like 
a extra stack of 20 generals and I just don't have the income for that uh, this is painful but we'll we'll nickel and dime them maybe there's nothing here in Bahamas and we can take the Bahamas which is a really nice rich region uh, as well and we'll see maybe we can I mean it, there's no space here I got some some tricks in mind to get them out of the city to take the city but we'll get to that later all right in the meantime uh okay, so we're making 537 here let's let's just end the turn i'm going to carry the 2000 and add it to the next turn then we can build up one of our uh regions to uh the next the top level of uh the government building and that really helps our tax income Either that or can spend it on a 2,000 uh, level, the second to top. Who knows, maybe we'll finally get a fleet battle over in Gibraltar. Doesn't seem like it. Alright, so we got another building constructed. We're actually at 4,048. Make it 2,149, so our income is starting to get on the rise is nice to see this building is completed and that's very nice to see that is our maximum there this building can be increased and that is starting to make some nice money um, yeah it gives us a nine percent bonus let's go ahead and spend it there still can't recruit any more men from anywhere because we're at our maximum number of troops, which is utterly insane. Maybe it's due to population levels. I have no idea what is the cause there, but who knows. Oh, Jesus, Louise. This is not going to be easy at all. All right. Um, yeah. Whew. Because these guys got seven morale as well. Got a general. Let's hold that thought. Let's get you guys up this way as well. Oh, lordy. Why can't I get natives? Jesus. Alright, let's add a general here. I hate doing it. It's an extra $800. I really can't spend. But might be necessary let's go ahead and fight it keep your fingers crossed boys and girls all right there they are at the bottom of the hill so we at least have the high ground but they're on the flat so it's not going to matter Our artillery is going to be an absolute non-factor in this as it is behind the defensive stuff here okay so three natives a general and a, two citizens so I'm gonna try and get these guys isolated in the small armies and maybe just maybe we can come out of this with something of a decent win speed this up while we traverse our way down the hill which we're pretty good ways off look at this no swords no nothing we just got our our badassedness our, our do rags our fists sweet little generals that's all we got that's all we got we're taking into this fight okay come on let's see if we can start separating these guys out why 
Why are you so lagging behind? Hustle. Hustle. There's kind of a downhill slope here, so I can't. I might be able to execute some downhill charges. We'll have to. We'll have to see how that works out. All right. keep maneuvering them around if we can get enveloped over around the the top part of the slope here of uh, the hill I'll be more than happy let's traverse you over I might pause this while I do that all right escalation has started Draw them in. Get them. All in, all in. So we got a decent enough charge. Got him hit from all sides here, teamed up. This is exactly what we wanted. Take him out one at a time. Look at punch him in the face. Bop! Don't get in front of the tomahawk. Punch him one. Knock his ass out. Plop. Plop. Ooh, look. Take his tomahawk. Or not. All right, he's done. Look at this. Boys, you done did good. You done did good. All right, back, back, back. All right, you guys. Spread. You guys. Come over here. We need you guys resting now. You're winded and active. So we need a little bit of a break. Don't look like we're going to get much of one. Hustle. Get the next victim coming in. Ah, or not. Good, that gives me a little rest. Let's speed this up so I can... Okay, good. He went from winded to active. Active, winded, winded, active now. Winded, winded. Come on. Laven up, boys. Laven up. Fresh, fresh. Active, active, active. Good. Not far, and they'll all be fresh. Okay. Which one is the general? I believe it could be the citizen, sadly. Or no. Oh, here he is. It's the general there. What am I talking about? Durr. Fresh. Okay, good. All right. Let's continue on with our plan, which was to envelop. Get slightly more uphill. All those bodies in the grass. Came out of that relatively well. Lost 9, 11, 1, 1, and 10. 
they lost the full unit, so I'm definitely liking those odds. Okay, we're definitely taking the hill route with these three. Okay. So basically they got two natives left. That's the whole heart of their army. Where's the other citizen? I can't see. Oh well, no matter. You spread here. Actually you over here. You over here. You over here. Okay, there he is. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, uh, we got somebody coming in. The musket fire unit. Let's see if we can draw them in. Or not. Okay, back, back, back. I don't want to wear you down running away from the fight. Come on. Okay, we're about to do this. Start a chain reaction here. Okay, let's start going. Let's do a walking charge. Okay, go. Push through. Okay, kill that general, please. Losing a lot of men there. Punch through. Punch through, baby. Okay, one down. About to be another. Come on, get out of there, General. Next General, hit him. Good, good, good. Losing a lot of men here. Okay, got one native down. Excellent news. Get the General. Solve a lot of our problems. Get him. Good Lord. What a mess. What a mess. Come on.
break them. Good, 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 good. They're screwed now. It's down to 15. Man, I've lost a heap of men. Come on, get them. Down to 38 on that unit. My lord. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, good job. Whew. What a day, what a day. Heroic victory I ain't won. Alright, so we lost 290, they lost 522. Just think that's a weak army. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so let's see if we can recruit some more now. Since they ugh, you gotta be shitting me. Six of six is all I can get. Look at that. Six of six. They must hate my guts. Mmm. 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 Damn it. I don't even have six. What the? Oh, yeah, I do. I have it in here. Jesus. Now i got to spend all kinds of money to fix these guys up. $1,400 to fix these guys up. Making 27 next turn, at least. Jesus. Huh. I hope this Guatemala makes me some money for that. Alright, let's end the turn. What a mess. Alright, 2500 is what we're starting out with. Okay. Let's take a look at a few things. This region is pretty undeveloped. We're only making 316 out of this region. I guess let's consolidate our army. I'm really pissed that I can only recruit six freaking units. Six of six. Jesus, they really have a handicap on the pirates. Uh, Alright, so... That being said, there's not much I can really build here this turn. I could fix up my men, but honestly, I'd rather fix up my economy. I think that's more of a priority, so that's what we're going to do. Um, I guess, let's look at, Jesus, which one first? Guatemala has more potential. Let's build up Guatemala first. Making 28 next turn. That's quite nice. It's because my army got a blood of fucking raided. So, <laughs> yeah. I mean, look, look at this. I've got a unit with 38 men. I mean, the rest of them didn't do terribly bad. I mean, right around half strength they lost. Uh, but, I didn't really lose any of the general's bodyguards, which was nice. Um, yeah, so... That was a pretty intense battle. So I think that's a good place to lead this episode. So with Guatemala now secured, now we're looking at a little bit more difficult challenges. I can either sweep over here and take a look at taking Cuba, Cuba, or as a matter of fact, let's see if we can, I don't think we're close enough to take a peek at what Cuba has, but we will scamper over there and see what they got and then we're gonna look at maybe taking uh, Mexico out if we could get Mexico that's a very rich region to have and frankly I don't know if we're going to be able to hold off the Pueblo uh, but I, I have some tricks up my sleeves that we can pull off. I uh, don't want to give them away just yet, but 
I think this is how I can maybe take some of these regions here that have line infantry. I just can't do it in these small little islands because I need space to pull this off. So, like I said, I'll, I don't want to give it away. We'll, we'll discuss it next episode. So if you did enjoy this, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button as it does help the channel as we're trying to make our way to a thousand subscribers. So please help us get there and subscribe. And we will see you on the next one. Thank you again, guys.